Hey guys, what's up? I have another thrift haul for you. It's kind of a small one, but I do have two bigger items I want to show you. So I'm just going to hop right into it and show you these small items first. So um, the first thing that I picked up at Horrible Savers, I say horrible because their prices are horrible, is this candle holder. I liked it, obviously, because it has the handle. I don't have any like this. And at first I thought it might be older, but then I saw... The caution sticker on the bottom so it's not that old but it's still pretty cool and i think i'm gonna put it in i'm gonna put it upstairs somewhere probably in the guest room so next i picked up this little guy um he's the smallest thing i've ever seen absolutely adorable it's gonna go in my chicken nester it doesn't have any markings on it he was two bucks and yeah i did have a 20 percent of coupon but i didn't use it because i ended up only spending like 18 dollars and i didn't want to waste my coupon on eighteen dollars on weirdo. All right, so this next thing, I saw it last time I went to Savers. You guys are gonna think I'm weird, but I think it's so cute, and it was there again this time. So I was like, you know what? For five dollars, I'm gonna pick it up. And you guys, it's a little vase. I am looking for one of those um, vases of the. It's like a head of a woman from like the fifties. I want one so bad. So this kind of reminded me of it. And the thing that sold me on this, as you guys know, I love, you know, initials on old things. On this side, there's a heart, and you can see there's an initials on both sides. And then, same with this. So, I don't know if someone made this, or I think there was a sticker on it. I don't know. There's no other markings, but I thought it was adorable, and I don't know. What am I going to do with this? <laughs> I just think it's so cute, and old and different that's why i like it so i know my taste is not everyone's taste but i'm gonna clean it up and it's gonna look adorable and it'll match any brass stuff i put it with because of the gold trim on it so i really like that about it so this is the next thing that i found another brass piece i'm gonna use it for um <clears throat> excuse me for a plant a real plant this was four bucks um not much to say about this looks like one of those um things they used to spit in in the olden days what are they called it kind of reminds me of that maybe it is one i don't know they did have one there but i didn't know. um so yeah that was four bucks and i have a plant i'm actually going to show you the three plants that i got from walmart in this haul too so that i can show you what i'm going to do with the this last thing that i got at savers was this um it's like a little lantern that you can hold it's so cute the bottom is silvery um, it looks gold. It's like silvery gold. I don't know. The top is like uh, colored yellowy. I, I don't know how to explain this. But I didn't take the tape off yet. I love the shape of it. It's four. It was five bucks. I think I can put some sort of candle in there. But if I just sit it like that, it's still adorable. I mean, am I right? I thought it was really unique. Um, it has this sticker on the bottom. I don't know what it means. It could be the price, $28 at one point, but I really like this, so I was very excited to find it. Before I go and show you the two bigger pieces that I picked up from the Facebook Marketplace, I wanted to show you the three plants that I got from Walmart. They actually had a really good selection of little plants like this, and it's exactly what I was looking for. So I picked up these three. Um, this one's a holly fern. I love this one. Love, love, love it. This one's called a lemon button fern. And then this is Ivy. So um, I did pick up this as well. I think it was like $5 or something, for something at Walmart. Um, so I think I'm gonna put this fern in here, just like that. And then with my new gold one, I might put this one, or vice versa, I don't know yet. So I don't know if they'll stay near each other, probably not. This one's probably going to go upstairs in the guest room makeover. And um, this one will probably stay in the kitchen. I wanted another ivy plant for my mantle, so that's why I got that. And the plants were, I want to say they were under $4 each. Yeah, $3.96. Can't be that. upstairs in my daughter's playroom, which is being transitioned into a guest room. I picked this piece up on Facebook Marketplace for $30. Now, if I was going to resell this, I wouldn't have paid $30 for it. But since I wanted, like, an, you know a chippy old looking table for the side table in this room it fit the bill and honestly in the picture it looked a lot bigger so I was kind of surprised when my husband brought it home and I was like 
Oh, that's small. <laughs> um, but anyways, it's perfect for a side table. Awesome handles. And I just have to clean it up a little bit, but I put my plant on there. For now. Got the bed today off Facebook Marketplace, and it was only $50, and the character and detail of this thing is amazing. I do have to clean it up a little bit. We ordered a mattress on Amazon, so that should be here tomorrow. Um, but look at this. I still have to get some of her toys, like, situated out of here, but this bed is amazing. It's an old brass bed. I've been looking and looking for one forever, and I finally found one. My husband went to go pick it up, and one of my favorite parts is it's on casters. I don't know if you, you probably can't see that, but it's on casters, so it's an old bed. I love it so much. I didn't want to spend over $100 on a brass bed, um, so I ended up finding this one for $50. And I bought some sheets today at Target for it. Um, I still haven't gotten like a, you know, a comforter set or anything like that because I'm still toying around with walls. And um, what I had mentioned on my Instagram was this wall is kind of weird that the headboard is on. It's a slanted roof. So I was thinking about doing peel and stick wallpaper. Um, I went to Target. I didn't like anything that they had. <clears throat> I, I, my thought is that if I, this is kind of going off on a tangent now, sorry. Um, my thought is if I do like a pattern, I'll get sick of it. If I do like a full looking shiplap, because I know they have that wallpaper, it's more neutral and, you know, I might be able to get with, get away with multiple themes. You know what I mean? Because I wanted to kind of do like a floral pattern at first, but now I'm like, eh, I don't know. So it would only be on this wall and then I would paint the rest something to you know match it let me know what you think down below it does have a window here so i'd have to get some curtains um let me know your thoughts so that's it for my haul guys i hope you guys enjoyed if you like this video don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next one bye